It is day five. It is day five. Everything after this was recorded in a different session. <laughs> hey guys, so um, today is day five, like I said, and everything, this is the last one out of the ones I've got prepared uh, before October 1st. Everything else will be drawn after October 1st. Um, so I, I, I will talk about the batches. I'm planning on doing them in batch of fives, but I will say for transparency's sake, because I like knowing when things were done in relation to other things when I watch videos. I don't know about anyone else, but I love that. Um, so today's prompt was cozy treat um, and I really like this prompt uh, at first I was like what the fuck is a cozy treat and then I googled what people consider cozy treats and I found out that s'mores are considered a cozy treat so of course I had to do s'mores I'm a member of s'more we gotta do s'more shit gotta represent <laughs> so I was like right we'll do s'more uh, how do I do that <laughs> so I thought what I would do is I'd just get like a giant s'more and then try my hand at doing that open mouth cartoony thing Thing where they open their mouth ridiculously wide. I'm, I've always been bad at that, but I think I did it good today. I realized you gotta keep the head still facing up. I always crane the head back and it looked weird. You don't crane the head back, you just open the mouth, you just raise the head up. That's it. Um, and yeah. Uh, for the light source in this, I decided to go with campfire because it's, it's small. Um, where do we s'mores? Well, camping. So we got an outside setting. I love my outside setting. Outside night theme, chill. Um, and yeah, just a, a little lady frog. Uh, I mean, these frogs are genderless, but I did draw eyelashes. Um, <laughs> in my head, she's a lady frog. She can be whatever you like. I don't really care. It's a frog. <laughs> they don't need gender. Um, so I did a little frog sitting down, you know, eating, eating a, eating a small chilling by the campfire and uh i was like okay okay what do i do i block out the background i do silhouettes trees you know uh, so obviously your eyes immediately drawn to that moon or the frog it depends on how you are but i really like the division between the clean artwork and the more messy background it's like it's like my first background but night themed i really like having full background like this you get to play with colors a lot and i thought yeah what colors go with space uh purple and pink Little did I realize, I made the sky bisexual. I didn't do that on purpose, but I'm more than happy to accept it. Now this is a bisexual frog. That's canon. Fuck you. <laughs> it's canon. I get to say it's canon. This frog has no gender, but they sure are bisexual. <laughs> That's a quote. <laughs> um, but yeah, I really like the way it turned out, actually. Um, I think it is cozy, but it also has nice night vibes. You know, I can, I've been watching too much anime because I can hear the cicadas going... And we don't have cicadas in England. So, yeah, I've been watching anime too much. I actually haven't. The last anime I watched was Cyberpunk, um, which is recent to be fair but that's the only way anime i've watched for a while but um either way i really like the frog in this one i like the little curled up tail because they have longer tails of course it kind of curl up and the little drippy drips of the marshmallow and small because as i imagine smalls would be like i actually had a small full disclosure um when we did the small day out which is the whole name of the small group based off of that um it was well i didn't have any vegetarian uh, marshmallows so i didn't actually have any smalls i want to make smalls at some point i do plan on doing that uh because i've actually found some vegetarian marshmallows they're pretty good they're called danny's i think or dandies um it's an american brand and they're really good vegan marshmallows that actually melt and they taste just like regular marshmallows which is great um, you can only find them in Holland and Barrett in England, uh, but it's a lot cheaper than ordering them online. And yeah, for some reason Americans have more p vegan marshmallows. I mean, we have vegan marshmallows, it's not that good. We have like these weird little sloth ones, you may have seen them. But they're not good, <laughs> like they are good, they are good, especially the little ones. They're good in their own right, but they ain't marshmallow. They ain't just a generic, you know, marshmallow. Um, but yeah, I like this, it makes me happy. I made the frog bisexual. Um, I'm just gonna go into, actually no, I'm not gonna go into the actual, I'm gonna fangirl a bit. I love the fucking division, the way the, the, the moon melts into the sky. I love that. That is my shit. Obviously, I drew it. <laughs> Um, I really like drawing night skies. Drawing night skies makes me happy. It's a nice peaceful vibe. Um, and, uh, yeah. I don't know what day six is, but I hope it's good. <laughs> I haven't checked the prompt list. Uh, I'll probably record the next five after, you know, finishing editing these. Um, so hopefully my vibe's not off too much, but there may be a noticeable difference. Doesn't matter. It's it's frog the froggy fall. Um, yeah. This is the end of the video. Hope you enjoyed. Uh, 
Look at it. It's the picture. Oh, isn't that good? Um, you can find all these on Twitter, by the way. Link in the description. Um, I do post. I will post all these on Twitter as well as making them a profile picture each day. Um, but I'll definitely post these on Twitter. So if you want the full thing, I'm not gonna put watermarks or anything. You can take them. Just have them. Use them any way you like. Just don't. Just give me credit. You know, give me credit. Uh, but yeah, it's good shit. Um. I'll see you tomorrow where I absolutely have no idea what I'm going to draw, which is exciting. Because that means I'm almost done. <laughs> uh, have a good one. I'll see you tomorrow. Love you. Bye. Bye.